season 13, episode 27, and that's the Raw episode we're going to watch together. Kurt, are you ready to start this? I could be more ready. Yeah, to get it over with. I know what you're saying. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right, here we go. In three, two, one, play. <laughs> I better hit the mute button before we get flagged on YouTube. But damn, I love that intro to Monday Night Raw. It's badass. It really is. Oh, oh, yeah. oh I just don't want to get us flagged. But man, I would have listened to the whole thing. Here we are. <laughs> that felt like a big time entrance to Raw. Carlito, it's Hulkamania. And they have all the 80s footage to show him coming down the road. The kids jumping around them. This is going to be an exciting one, Kurt. It will be. This will be a fun Raw to watch. All right. Well, listen, uh, let's jump into it. Set the stage for what we go on, uh, have going on here, because as we begin the show, uh, it is live, as you can see here, uh, Sacramento, and uh, they're coming off of Vengeance 2005. And Kurt, you and I covered that a few weeks ago. Kurt, you defeated, and man, they're showing some graphics, and I see Sergeant Slaughter's bikini boot camp. Uh, <laughs> that's one segment we're not going to fast forward this evening, Kurt. Uh, <laughs> go ahead and share that. The champ is here tonight. We got Chris Jericho and John Cena together in the highlight reel i can't wait to hear some of that go back and forth yeah i agree with you man those two are the, some of the biggest stars in the business in the history of the business so as i said uh, we covered that a few weeks ago kurt defeated rick flair with the ankle lock on that show so kurt while we wait for carlito to come out we'll listen a little bit of his cabana uh, show here what was it like wrestling the nature boy uh back in 2005 you know what, Rick? Rick was a lot of fun to wrestle because he did a lot of stuff that was, um, you know, he did a lot of stuff that people recognized. He had these certain bumps that he took that he always took. The one off the top rope where you flip him over. Uh, when he when you punch him, he does that face bump where he does a silly thing and bumps forward. Oh, I love so it. Rick had all these different bumps that he did, and he kept that in his repertoire as he got older. Although he couldn't wrestle like he used to uh, at this point in time in two thousand five. He was still good. He, he was past his prime, though. So he did all those trademark moves, and he still was very entertaining. And he was a lot of fun to work with. 